guys, welcome back to my channel. Oh, Rachel, now you wanna FaceTime me. <sighs> I'll call her in five seconds. Um, so today I'm gonna be vlogging because I have a super fun day. So I have a hair appointment this morning. I'm just getting my dark redone because as you can see, it's kind of faded. And then I have a super, 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 super exciting appointment. Um, I feel like this is gonna take a lot of explaining, so I will get more into that, but I am getting boobs. So I have my consultation today after my hair appointment and I'm going to be picking my implants, picking my surgery date, uh, and just talking about everything with the surgeon and yeah, I'm gonna try to vlog as much of both these processes, my hair and my boob appointment as I can, but I'm not gonna be like bringing my camera in, so I'm gonna try to just film on my phone a little bit and I don't know how much footage I will be able to get, but I will get more into explaining the boob job and everything like that, but right now I'm going to FaceTime Rachel back and I'm gonna put on a little bit of makeup. Um, just so I feel awake. I got my Starbucks this morning. I'm ready to go. So, this is gonna be a super exciting vlog. Um, if you're not subscribed, make sure you subscribe and follow me on Instagram to stay updated on my life. Okay, let's go. So I feel like the start to this vlog was kind of complicated because I started vlogging and then I stopped because Rachel called me and I wanted to talk to her. Um, I made some breakfast. I put some makeup on and then I took it off. Honestly, I still have eye makeup on, but I used a tinted moisturizer on my face and I hated it. I walked outside and got in my car and I looked in the mirror and I was like, oh no. So. I ran back inside and washed it off and I just got to my hair appointment so this is it before it's gonna be the same it's just gonna be all dark I do have like some pieces that just I used to be blonde so little highlights come through my hair anyways um I'm gonna go into my hair appointment and I will update you guys in a little while with this lighting why do I look pink uh I don't know okay so I'm done with my hair I love it shout out to my girl Brie the lighting in here is so bad but yeah okay so hair is done so fire as always and now I am off to my boobie consultation I also forgot to mention that I'm going to the melting pot tonight with my friend Molly which is gonna be so good and I can't wait to bring you guys because the melting pot is fire I act like you're gonna be able to eat it but um, you can see it and smell it through the camera and it's just so good I just got to my appointment I haven't gone inside yet I hope I can like find it because this building is huge and hopefully I can find like where he is so I'm like 25 minutes early and honestly I might just go in because I need to find where I'm going and also I want to get in there like 10 minutes early anyway so I'm really excited I'm kind of nervous I just hope that I can get a surgery date um, when I want it, I really am shooting for July, so I hope I can get that. Um, we'll see. I'm just looking over all my paperwork to make sure everything's filled out. But yeah, okay, so like I've been saying, I don't know how much I'm gonna be able to film in there because obviously, like, I'm not gonna just whip my camera out, I'm gonna be kind of busy, but I will try to record when I put the implant bra like the surgical bra with the implants in it 
I will try to get like some phone footage of that. I need to take videos anyway, so I have them and like I can show my mom. So either way, I'm gonna get some sort of pictures or videos. So I will put that in, but yeah. I'm gonna go do that and then I will update you guys on how it went and tell you all of, like the technical things that I decide on. I can't believe this is really happening right now. Like, ah, like is this real? I've waited for this moment since I was like 10 years old. Okay, yeah, wait, let's talk about this real quick. So I don't want anybody to try to lecture me or come for me or tell me that I shouldn't do this or that I don't need it or what, I mean, you know, it is what it is. People are always gonna say like, oh, you don't need it, but I just want support. Like, I'm doing it. The, my mind has been made up since I was like 12 years old. My mom always had nice boobs and I always wanted them. <laughs> like, I am 25, I'm about to be 26. I know what I'm doing and I want boobs. It's not like I am too young for them. I'm not like, there's just no reason. If I can do it, why not do it? If I wanna change something about myself that's gonna make me feel more confident, why not? Trust me, I love small boobies. Like I have liked mine, they're fine, but I'm just ready to feel like grown. I don't fit in any bathing suit tops. I don't fit in a lot of clothing, dresses, tops literally like anything because i straight up have nothing like i have no boobs and just as like a 25 year old woman i kind of want some boobies it's just a personal preference i have nothing against small boobs it's just like i like mine i just want to be able to fit in things and for me personally i just want them okay it's starting to rain so i'm gonna go in before it rains bad but i'll update you guys All right, so I am back home now. I am in the best mood. Let me set up my little tripod. <gasps> Part of my tripod broke off in my purse. I can find it. Oh, there it is. Let's just attach that baby. Okay. <laughs> uh, this is so lopsided. <laughs> okay, is that fine? All right. I'm like, let's try this for the millionth time. I just got home from my consultation. I do not think it could have gone better. I am so confident in my decision. I'm confident in my surgeon, the nurses, everyone was just amazing. I am so, I don't think I'm gonna stop smiling until my surgery date. So I'm not gonna say when my surgery date is, but it's soon. It's soon, guys. It could have been sooner. I literally could have gotten an appointment for next week, <laughs> but I have some things going on, so I can't. My mom's going out of town that weekend. I was like, of course. So it's not that soon, but it's pretty soon. So you guys are going to have to be watching my channel and make sure you don't miss that vlog. That's going to be crazy. But... I am just so excited. I decided on 295 cc, which will put me around like a full C. Um, it st they still looks small, like when I put the shirt on, I'll insert a clip, but you can tell that like, they look like, I'm just, like it, I feel like it looks pretty normal. I feel like th with the shirt on, it kind of looks like how I look like in a shirt when I'm wearing a bombshell, except, those are just gonna be my actual boobs. So honestly, I feel like it's not going to be that crazy, but well, it is. No, it is, it is, it is. Oh my gosh. So I'm doing 295 cc high profile silicone. So there's low profile, then there's like a medium, moderate, then there's high, and then there's ultra high, and I'm doing the high. So I was really torn between high and moderate, but the, moderate just has more of like it like slopes more um up here and the high profile is more rounded at the top so that's kind of what i wanted they said that's what looked really good on me so i felt confident in that and um i just they said that basically with the high profile it'll just look like i'm wearing a push-up bra which is everything I want. All right, sorry if the angle just switched a little bit. My camera ran out of storage. Okay, so yeah, 
that's everything I want. Like it's gonna look like I'm wearing a push-up bra without a bra and I am just freaking out. I will definitely get more into detail and do like a whole Q&A and stuff after I get my boobs done, I'm sure. And I will be vlogging my surgery. So you'll see a little bit of me on here before that because it's not that soon, but it's soon. I'm just so excited. Um, I hope that you guys don't think I'm crazy, but if you do, I don't really care because I'm doing it. So I'm about to get ready and then go pick up Molly Bell. We're going to the melting pot, like I said earlier. And we have a lot of girl talk to have, so I'm super excited. And I will vlog as much as I can while I'm there. Um, so yeah, let's go get Molly Bell. Hi guys, so I am currently editing this video and I realized that I did not end it. I was just having such a good night with Molly that we didn't really film much and I didn't do an outro. So here's the outro. Um, I hope that you guys liked this video. I can't wait to have a more informative vlog coming for you guys very soon. Of course, like I said, when I do get my surgery, which is soon, <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm freaking out guys. I've been online shopping since my appointment because I'm gonna actually fit in like bikinis now <laughs> This is a moment for me because I cannot even fill out an extra small bikini top Yeah, so I will definitely be vlogging my full surgery like I'm gonna be vlogging the night before, the morning of, okay. Yeah, I will film the morning of. My surgery is at 7 a.m., so I'm gonna be like half asleep, but um, when I get picked up, I will make sure that I am being like filmed, and yeah, it's gonna be a crazy, crazy vlog, and I will vlog while I'm in recovery and everything, and then after I recover, I'll do a whole Q&A and tell you guys all about it and answer any other questions that you guys might have. I've definitely had like a day to um, finally, like I'm like accepting like this is actually happening and it's so crazy, it's so crazy. Yeah, I hope that you guys did like this video and I hope that you're excited for more, not even just boob job vlogs, but um, I am gonna be vlogging more. I'm not on like a schedule right now because I feel like that just puts more pressure and then I feel like that's when I don't film. My life has actually been like a little bit more exciting lately. So I feel like I actually have things to vlog now where I had been in such a, like a hole after COVID and everything where my life just nothing was really going on. Where now I feel like my life is just taking a whole 360. I said in my last vlog that I kind of want to go through and like delete all my old vlogs and that's honestly because I really do feel like I've just gone through a really big change. Um, I said this before, I just feel like I'm not even the same person that I was in those vlogs. I'm in a completely different part of my life now. It's crazy. Things could change really fast. I don't know. I just feel like I'm like reborn right now. It's so weird. Anyways, I'm gonna stop rambling. I'll talk to you guys in my next vlog. Uh, don't forget to like this and subscribe if you're not subscribed because there's a lot coming. And also follow me on Instagram, add me on Snapchat, the whole shebang, keep up with my life. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.